BA Art and Tech, as a Slade offer, attracts curious students. They're all interested in how art and technology can intersect to investigate the world that we live in. Slade really has been at the forefront of pushing boundaries um, since it started, and this course is a natural extension of that. So I think it's a very important thing to use technology in art because, I mean, I guess art is kind of like this mirror that we hold to the society that we live in, the way life is at that time. So uh, the idea uh, behind of the new program Art and Technology is about producing art connected with uh, emerging and disruptive technology, experimenting new forms of collaboration, expression and communication. We use technology all the time, a lot of it hardly even knowing that we're doing it. And we would like our students to not only use it, but to critique it, work out how they can use it to disrupt. So by using these digital technologies, you are sort of expanding the art world. There's always new technology coming out. And so this is like new territory, which you get to explore and play with. I chose to study at this lane because I just knew that it's like a close-knit community. The teaching staff at the Slade, they're all amazing people. I admire a lot how caring they are with you, but also how much they're willing to like let go and let you figure out what you want to do. The ethos of self-direction is really important. So there are certain modules, so for instance VR, AI, sensing, machine learning, that give students the tools they need to then work on their art practice, which underscores the whole course. And that's where they will be self-directed, they'll be self-motivated to use those skills to work on their independent art practice. So in that sense, they have to really explore their interests, explore the medium as well as the material as a self-directed learning. So that self-direction really helps you grow as an artist and feel stronger about your practice and know it deeper and what it means to you and what you want to say. The BA Art and Tech course is based at UCL East and I think that the educational and cultural quarter that has sprung up here with UCL East, BBC, Sadler's Wells at VNA is a really exciting kind of buzz. You're surrounded by some people in other disciplinary areas as well and it's amazing to collaborate with them and there's so many resources there, not just within your course but in the societies and the people around you. Studying at UCL East feels really different because of the like vast range of like resources. For example, the Institute of Making is amazing and has like endless possibilities in that room. And also studying in London is just like nothing else. The galleries and museums and everything like that that's available. In terms of our students after their graduation, the way of how they learn is really learning the transferable skills. So in that sense, I see they will maybe continue to be practicing artists. They might be work in the art and technology education sector. And increasingly, we see a lot of cultural institutions that need to do public engagement in a way to promote digital or technological based artworks. You can really like bulk out that CV because you're learning so many practical skills as well as just having a conceptual maybe art practice. The Slade is an art school led by artists. Previous um, alums such as Paula Rago, recent Turner Prize winners, Jesse Darlin and Veronica Ryan, they came through those doors and a degree from the Slade is really something. There's so many reasons to love this laid. I particularly love my tutors and my friends and the influence that they have on my work, which is just boundless and beautiful and like nothing else I've ever experienced.